the poo poo, the sleep of mama, 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 go back to bed, mama, back to bed, back to bed. That's what I didn't know in that Dread Love and Arms. He's, he's a musician, but we don't know if he writes his own songs. I don't know if it's that song is a song he actually wrote for her. That's what I didn't get. I don't know if he was simply singing a song that there was a regular song on the radio or something that related to her situation, or if he actually wrote that song. I don't know. The movie doesn't say. That's the thing it doesn't tell me. That might be why I didn't mention it, that he, he sings that song. Because if he wrote it, then would that have been his song, they actually, his song, her friend's song, original song they actually sing in that movie? These are things I would have to go and ask people, and you can, like IMDB and stuff, has, it's this place that you can go where people ask questions about a movie if they don't understand something. But it being a true story and whatnot, I can't even believe people have trashed it. But again, because hmm. everybody's different, you know. And when we two and a half times, that's beautiful, beautiful, realistic movie. People just don't like it. It's always gonna be people that don't like shit. <sighs> Sleep, yes, sleep, sleep, don't go sleep. Go nighty night, nighty night. Like, yes, yeah, Mama, what are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Ah, we're gonna go to the car first. Okay, and then go on, go on. Let's go to the car first. Why I have plastics on this pillow? Well, for the record, my mom does too. If you were to go into her room and see in her pillows, they're all they're all crinkly. She's got the plastic wrapped on the same day of reason. And she had two dogs to contend with, worrying about Angel Arrow or peeing on her pillow. And it's happened to her, and like the when it's like late, you know, you turn around and the dogs. It was Angel had gone to the bathroom and you have to wash all your blankets, you have to, I mean, you have to get them off the bed and it's just a big hassle, you know, and pee on the pillow ruins it, so I had it happen to me once when I had the two new pillows and I'm like, it's not going to happen again, at least he, he likes, you know, at least if he pees on the pillow, it's not going to ruin my pillow, it can just, you know, if there's plastic on it. And she didn't understand that, I guess, because it would bother her sleeping on it. Why do you have that crinkly thing still on about her? It doesn't bother me when I'm sleeping. I don't hear it. It doesn't. Same as it doesn't bother my mom sleeping on the crinkly pillow. I think she does the same damn thing. She was doing it long before I was. Remember, before I moved in with Bobby, I had never, and I never would want to, slept with a dog any dog in my bedroom at night, period, okay, with Omar and Bobby and whatnot, I didn't have a choice, he would have sat there and screamed outside the bedroom door, 
Didn't have a choice, and I, I wouldn't do that to him anyway. Even if, you know, it's always a choice, of course, but I wouldn't do it to him because he's so used to. Ever since, you know, he got out of the pen or the, I don't know, the, the thing, wherever that is, Donald made for him, and started sleeping with Donald every night. And then when I went into the shelter here in Massachusetts, he slept with my mom every night. I would never have moved us to a brand new place and not let him sleep with it was a brand new experience for me, you know. It's okay. It's just when I first moved in there, Omar, you know, peed on the bed. Did you pee on my pillow? I can't remember. May have. I don't know which peed on the bed. You know, though. So. And that was the first time I'd ever had any dog sleep with me in my bed at night. Because, again, I'm not the type who wants the dog sleeping in my bed at night, but, you know. My mom is. She loves it, you know. She loved having them both. She told me the other day she missed this angel. I'm like, you could get angel, you gonna? She's like, no, I don't think so. Oh, Mom. I think you're just handling yourself enough and probably can't.